What's up ladies and gents and welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. We are here with another seasonal championship. This time old versus new. We have to use a B-class, either classic or modern sports car. I chose the modern because I prefer it and I'm going with the Mazda MX-5 from 2013. Tuning share code is in the description as always. Just quickly showing you a couple of the other cars. <coughs> MX-5, definitely a well-known and well-liked car all around. So I thought let's go with one of, one of the well-liked cars here. It's rare enough that we use something like this. So why not? There we go. The S2000 was another strong contender. I looked at that, but I decided for the MX-5 instead. Relatively cheap. Tune is fine as well. And we are already on the overtaking. Let's go past here. Oh, past here as well. Now on the inside. On the inside here. We're just weaseling through here. Triple pass. Well, we're breaking a little bit earlier, but that allowed us to accelerate earlier again. Which gave us an advantage there, and we're already in the lead. <coughs> 30 seconds in, we're. Already clear of everyone. This car with that tune definitely a stronger contender here. Should make your life relatively easy. A little bit of a tricky section here, but really nothing to worry about. Looks trickier on the map than it really is. For being honest, tapping the brake here a couple of times just to get the correct speed and line. Going a little off roady here. There's no need for it, but whatever. the lead already. And my hope would be that we can keep that lead. Or extend it even further. Because I really don't see anyone challenging us. And if all three races go that way, then this is going to be one of the more relaxed championships. Here, here we break a little bit harder now before the corner. That saves us from the adjustments in the corner. Going a little off road here again. Not entirely sure why, but line just feels good, I guess. Cutting that checkpoint. Lap is relatively short, so that's fine as well. It's basically a one minute lap, so I'll have to finish it in just a bit over three minutes. Coming from here now. That finishes the race. Here we go. Yeah, it was nearly three minutes of just managing the lead. We are in a good position. And with such a win already in, in the bag, 
one feels confident going into the next races. Alright, jumping into race number two. Come on, load. Load the race, please. There we go. This will probably be a similar result, or at least I hope so. Another free lap circuit race. Inside here. Gives us a decent chance of overtaking. If we stick to the inside here, we are free wide, which is never the easiest thing in a corner. Start a little bit more on the outside. Can we do it? Yeah, we can. Starting in. Oh, we were cut off there. Interesting. Here comes the overtake, and now we are already targeting first. Which took us longer than last time, to be fair. Targeting on the outside now. Oh, we couldn't do the switch move because we were too far next to him. Took him on the outside instead. be able to have a comfortable lead throughout the race now. Right now it's still relatively close, but generally speaking that's not an issue. B-class also a lot more controllable than let's say S1 or S2 class, where it's a lot easier to make mistakes, big mistakes. Whereas here just getting relatively clean around the circuit isn't that difficult. Race number two, right? A little hard on that, but it's okay. Yeah, we have a comfortable lead again. Not as big as in the last race. So the last race also suited us a little bit better. We're still in a relatively comfortable position. With roughly two and a half of the three laps done. Whoops. Got a little bit off the line, but again, we have a relatively comfortable lead, and we just have to bring it home, really. It wasn't such a good lap. Expected to be considerably slower than the previous one. Yeah, it's second slower. Well, considerable is doing a lot there, but that's two races in the bag. That's 40 points in the bag. And it's a 10 point lead. I would very much assume. But we can bring this one home now. Where's the last race? <clears throat> Where is it? Probably 
probably already scrolled over, right? Where is it? Oh, down here. Yeah, it's totally easy to see. This track should suit us a little bit better again. <coughs> Regarding how well we can take the lead and keep the lead. But we'll see. Not so bad. Wait and wait and wait. Come on, this is taking longer than the actual race. I'm not entirely sure why. There we go, there's the race. With a 10 point lead, I think like 5th or something should be enough, but 4th at least. To be safe. But we very much do not want like a fifth or a fourth or whatever. We want a win. That's what we are going for. Already up to fourth. And now darting in here? No. The blue Nissan was kind of in the spot that I wanted to occupy. But then I couldn't. Because, well, he was there already. I'm poking the nose in and overtaking both of them. Taking the lead in the first lap again. This lap is a little bit longer than the other ones, but not much. Actually, it's quite considerable if you, can, if you think about it. The other ones were, I think, 103, 104, 107, something in that range, and now we're at 120, very much 120s. We might get below that, below 120, but not really willing to take any big risks, so we'll see. Just want to bring home the victory. Checkpoint after checkpoint done, and each of them gets you ever so much closer to the finishing line. Because right now it's just managing the lead and managing the championship lead. As always, we want to finish with 60 points. It's looking good so far. So really, the, the goal is avoid any big blunders, and we're fine. It's looking like we can get below 120 here, I think. Yeah, 118.6. I'm waiting for the comment that says I did it in 112 or something because I'm so good. Congratulations! I applaud your skill. After a certain time you really stop caring about other people and you just do your thing. That happens as you get older, I think. The older you get, the less you care about what other people are doing. Or at least that's what happens with me. I guess everyone is different there. There's also a lot of older people that are completely in the yellow press thing. Oh, what is he doing? And what is that guy doing? Oh, we're having beef. Oh, that's totally interesting. 
I'm just so alive. What the hell are you talking about? Who cares about that? The spectacle of other people's lives is beyond my comprehension. I guess. It's a slower lap, I think. Ah, it was roughly the same. 118.5, probably a little bit faster. Can't see it right now, unfortunately. But hey, whatever. Nope, 118.612. Is that the lap I had? Or? Tough to tell. At least we won. We won the championship. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. And until next time, farewell.